Well, hello and welcome once again. j 76 on the way here, playing Distant Worlds 2 as the Hakonish. That's episode number 37 of our playthrough. Uh, right now we are looking at our uh, colony system in Corenda. Uh, we do have the 23rd Invasion Fleet of uh, the Ubus Republic coming at us. Uh, I'm not really sure if there's anything I'm going to be able to do to appease these guys and get them to stop attacking me. Um, 32nd Fleet is still is out here as well. Uh, we've got the 2nd Fleet moving down to the uh, Miranda system uh, to take up position near our base. Uh, 1st Fleet is moving as well, although they have uh, quite a few damaged ships. Um, I'm going to try and avoid outright battles with these guys. Uh, although it may come to that. Like I said, I don't know. I don't think I can appease them uh, in any way. The Ubus Republic is furious with us. Uh, we're trying to befriend them, but not working very good. So, in terms of research goes, we are orbital escape launchers and then uh, dedicated carriers. Let's get the clock rolling on the Hack 76 playthrough. I am the mission. We build that research base because it gives us some pretty good bonuses there. Uh, Eculon shortage, so yes. That. The hive is also somewhere in the background causing problems. Uh, we can give them that. It's fine. Pause here. Uh, I'm going to hold off on that just because I don't know if I'm going to be in possession of the Karanda system for very much longer. Uh, Theta Ulros Ascendancy offers military refueling. Mining rights. Uh, we're trying to make good with everybody in the galaxy, and we've done fairly well with that. Just... Uh, Oh, a defensive pact? That's what I've been looking for. This is exactly what I've been looking for. That's what I was going to say, is uh, in my attempt to get these guys on my side enough where they will uh, take up a defense or a military partnership to help us out with the Ubus Republic. But they haven't, so far, been open to that idea. It looks like they're open to it now, so... Good thing for us. Guess maybe we just have to wait for the Ubus Republic to attack us now. Yeah. But they are encroaching our little territory here. We've got the Corenda colony there. We've got soul here. Uh, gonna accept that. Exploration and territory. Let's take a look here. Nineteenth fleet of the Ubus Republic moving in on our carrier. In the this is probably their fleet over here. I don't need that. Let's see what happens here. Okay, so we are in battle with the uh, Republic here. Like they left. Or not. 
Hello. This could be problematic. We got a battleship. Going after the hive hall. Oh, mining station. Attacked by the hive. There, there. Carrier with a strength of 35,000. So wipe out their mining station. Closer and closer. Wiped us out there. I wonder if they're attacking anyone else. A major battle here, which we're losing. or fighters coming at us. Uh, they want... Or they're going to give us 37,000, so take that. Sandstorm for the Nalgelians. Like our forces out in this area have been kicked out. We have a passenger ship. It's uh, out here. Apparently, they don't care about. It does look like the Tekans are. Area as well. If anything happens here. Pass on that one. That's a problem because that is a, our one of our. Lost that ship. We are making the uh, way here. Get their carrier up. Pause here for a second. Salvaging a power conduit in the Coranda system made the research breakthrough in decoys. victory here against the uh an attack of three
major space battle here. Behold, if we destroyed the battleship. Oh, we didn't. oh, they took out our carrier. No. Ah, crap. Pause, pause, pause. Battle site, no. Lost the battle site. That sucks. Okay, here we go. Shove all this before we do anything. Uh, how's our first fleet looking? There's the rest of it. We don't have. We just got one slate. Um. Time to go. station. Where's my allies? Yeah, colony. All right, well, 
We're obviously winning the war. Even if no war has been... We have much left. Five ships. All those ships have been dead. Dedicated carrier research complete. Time for a big enemy fleet. Let's pause here and pick a. Uh, pick a. Uh, Able. Research projects here. Long range point defense. Certain 18 days, long range beam weapons. Add up. Blasters. 92 days. All these are taking less than. It's an area weapon. Thick weapons. <clears throat> Pass energy. It'll help us our guys get out of harm's way faster. Defense tactics. You have multi layer planetary defenses. Maybe too late to save our colony, but that's our cue for now. Right. Recovered. Now 
was a disaster. Oh, all right. Have to start building up uh, another fleet here. I can do about that. Take money though. Hang on to it. That's pretty bad. Most of our ships are in now. Fuel tankers. We got some some frigates left. Two, three, three frigates. That's what we have. Two, three. Plus a destroyer. Ones are getting sick. Uh, they offer swarm missiles, high intensity beams. I'll, I will gladly play, pay 22000 for all of that. Possibly build we build a defensive base. Spaceports on the back. That's our defensive pack from the Okay. Oh, boy. with the more talons. Back to our space. How that works. Oh.
Everywhere we look, the Witcher Pokemon. Iron Syndicate. Russian Treaty. Now. Oh. The Earth's Kingdom has completely destroyed the Iron Syndicate. New defensive base is beat. Take a look. It's not. Ships are starting to come off the assembly line. Boss of Quake. Ubis Republic can't really care. We should have some cruisers hanging out here now. station here. Do this. The game doesn't freeze up. Gonna go all of my colonies. I, I guess we're out of. Uh, Hive. to see these big wide open spaces pop up here. I'm wondering what it's all about. Oh.
solid disc here. High powered blaster research complete. Uh, operations map sharing. Okay. Ah, just a gravel. Fighters Research Project will pay for that. Pay for that. Finance wizards at our colony Seoul have figured out a way to temporarily boost economic output through some creative accounting. Advanced Blasters. Okay. What? Give us a spy. <coughs> Pass on that one. <coughs> but I will take the advanced blasters. Much popping up here. You can keep up with it. planet they're under attack defensive pact I understand why anyone uh, isn't coming to my aid here hacking me everywhere got a new ambassador well, let's see using the diplomatic channels, but somehow I doubt it. <clears throat> A new defensive base has been completed at Rudus 3.
have here. Uh, new medium space force complete. Full lamb, which is right there. Seem to be making any moves on the colony. That might just be because they haven't gotten here yet. You have a pretty strong presence in the system, so. Force and the uh, 43rd Invasion Fleet and the 13th Invasion Fleet are all up here at Rockranda uh, Junction. I think we built we got a carrier that's built. Got this destroyer attacking training station. But it kind of defend itself, but it's just a mining station. Alright, we got a carrier now, so I think that's all the ships that we, uh, we're gonna build. Going for the mining station. Select all. Eyes of game. Wind shift fleet, first fleet. So it's actually pretty powerful now. We got your planetary defense. 
Uh, that's multi-layer planetary defense. That's our last uh, thing there. Uh, and then I'm actually going to go away from the weapons. Trying to find stuff that Strike fighters. Uh, let me. Hey. special uh, network entertainment find some more uh, partially lead in here And sensor. Uh, advanced count. Fleet targeting. Probably a good thing. We're going to bump that all the way up to the top. It's not. here uh, let's see for a uh, colony brand I think If we have a some way of building ships out, I'm not entirely sure we do. I'm gonna check it out anyway. I'm gonna build a slew of ships here, spaceport. Almost got their shields down. No, 
We're not holding our own here for a second, Jeff. There we go. They're done, so. All right, I'm going to call the episode to a close here. Um, got our handed to us, but we did start rebuilding, so uh, hopefully we can... wasn't expecting our cruisers and that to give me such strength, but uh, we'll work on more of that. I may actually form... get that uh, fleet up to maybe 70, 75,000 for strength. And... Um, are building a second fleet. And maybe we could defend ourselves. Who knows? Uh, anyway, if you liked the episode, hit the like button. If you have any tips or advice, leave those in the comment section below. I'd like to follow along with the Hakonish in Distant Worlds 2. Hit the subscribe and come with us, and we will see you for next episode. J76NY saying thank you very much for watching, and have yourself a very good day.